Hi guys, this is Leonard and welcome to Elmas Vlog. For today's episode, let's travel to Thailand because we are going to prepare a Thai basil pork. And for our minimal ingredients, we will be needing the following garlic, chilies. The original recipe calls for a Thai chilies, but for my own take, I'll be using chili flakes. Of course, we will be needing ground pork, a handful of basil, sugar, oyster sauce, oil, soy sauce and we will also be needing fish sauce tara samahan niyo ako magluto sa kusina so let's start cooking by putting on the flame and heat the pan then add some oil just a little because remember we are using pork and the pork will render its own fat after which so just enough oil to saute our garlic so when the garlic turns a little bit brown, we can now add in the chili flakes. So all we have to do is to saute both and when the chili turns aromatic, we can now add in our ground pork. So for this particular recipe, I am just using 250 grams of ground pork. Just enough for a single serving for this no movement sundae. So we just have to saute well our ground pork until such that its fat will render. So continue sauteing until the ground pork firmed up. So at this juncture, as you can see, our ground meat has already turned into brown. So we can now add in our seasonings such as our oyster sauce. As it sizzles, we can actually add on our additional seasonings such as our fish sauce which is a very common condiment in almost every Thai cuisine. We will also be adding in a little of your soy sauce. For the original recipe, it actually uses the light and the dark soy sauce. But since in the Philippines, the common soy sauce is the generic, I am just plainly using our silver version soy sauce for this recipe. We can now also add in our sugar to balance the saltiness of our liquid seasonings. The sugar would add a little sweetness for this recipe. So we will just allow all our ingredients to sizzle on the pan so as all the flavors of our seasonings will come together and marry each other. We are now actually almost good with our recipe. The kitchen is now very aromatic so at this juncture we can now add in our last ingredient which is the handful fresh basil for the original recipe it actually uses the thai basil but since in the philippines it is more common to use our regular basil then this is what i am going to use with our recipe so all we have to do here is toss our fresh basil on our ground meat when the basil is now perfectly wilted and it's now aromatic then we are now good with our recipe so isn't it a very quick and easy recipe but trust me this is so good it is best served with steamed rice and a sunny side up egg so let us now plate our thai basil pork And so here's our thigh basil pork. Yum! And if you do love this video, please do like and share and drop a comment. 
At kung bago ka sa channel natin ito, huwag kalimutang mag-subscribe at hampasin ang notification bell para ikaw ay parating updated sa ating mga newly uploaded videos. Thank you guys for watching!